Hey guys. All right, before I tell you what this video is about, let me tell you a little bit about myself. My name is Davey. I'm a photographer and a dancer. My love for photography started in my late teen years. I suddenly took photography serious and decided to start off a photography business for myself. I went with KF Photography and from there on out my photography just became more serious. So I decided to go to college for photography. As for my dance, my love for dance started at the age of 13, seven years ago. I started dancing because it was one way to keep me out of trouble. Of course, at the time I wasn't even living, I was living in Detroit, not a really good area. Ever since then, seven years straight, I've been dancing nonstop, trying to improve myself. Also, for my goal with dance, I want to teach kids that you can always have fun no matter how bad you're living. There's always a way to have fun while growing up in a bad neighborhood. Now that you know some things about me, let me tell you some questions I've been getting lately. From my girlfriend, of course. Question one, when are you gonna dance for me? Or in front of me? Question two, why do you always dance with your friends and not for me? Girl, let me answer those two questions for you right now. For the first question, one day, that's all I can say is one day. For the second question, I dance in front of my friends or with my friends or for my friends because the connection we have is different from what I have with them. Honestly, I don't know how to say this or put this in terms or anything, but when you're around and you want me to dance, that makes my shyness build up quick like Yes, well, that's the truth. I can't dance in front of my girlfriend. That's my problem. That's why I'm making you this video today to ask you how I would feel more confident when she asked me to dance for her or in front of her or anything like that. So if you have any tips or anything to like, build my confidence up just so I can dance in front of my girlfriend, so, then please leave a comment down below because she asked me that question a lot lately and I'm tired of saying one day. That's all I always tell her is one day and I honestly don't know when one day is going to happen. 